Alexa, play Virgin Radio UK in the bedroom. Virgin Radio UK from TuneIn, playing on bedroom. Alexa, play heavy metal in the kitchen. All right. The station, all metal, on Amazon Music. Alexa, play country music downstairs. The station, all country, on Amazon Music. Alexa, play Bruce Springsteen upstairs. Shuffling songs by Bruce Springsteen on Amazon Music, playing on upstairs. Alexa off. There you go folks, Graham here with another Tech Tuesday on Living the Dream, proving that you can control Sonos with an Alexa Echo Dot, or should I say, I can control all of the Sonoses all over the house with all of our Alexa Echo Dots. So I think I said to you during the last Tech Tuesday that I had acquired another three Amazon Echo Dots which we placed here in my study, down in Fiona's study and in the kitchen. While they all work as fantastic as you would expect from Amazon Echo, the challenge that I was facing or had been facing is connecting them all with the Sonos system. Nothing changes folks, I think that Sonos is as flaky as hell their ecosystem is as flaky as hell, but their speakers are incredibly high quality. And it is fantastic that I've been able to finally, after a lot of fiddling about with software, to marry Alexa and Sonos together. However, if I was investing another 1,500 to 2,000 pounds on a brand new high quality speaker system for the house, I wouldn't be buying Sonos. And therefore, all that I wanted to do in this video was prove that I could get a little bit more life out of my Sonos system by connecting it to Alexa and allowing Alexa to communicate and provide incredibly high quality music across my Sonos system, wherever the speaker is in the house. In conclusion, I'm absolutely delighted, or should I say I'm still absolutely delighted with my Amazon Echo Dots that are dotted around the house. I'm of course, I'm Graham, and you've been watching Tech Tuesday here on Living the Dream. Thanks for watching.